Well, yeah, I, I mean, I suppose I'm, I'm back doing what I do. You know, um, I suppose that's the best you can say. Welcome back, then. <laughs> In his words, he never went away, but it's been a rocky road back to sobriety and back to music for Boy George. The release of his new single, Amazing Grace, comes almost two years to the day after he quit drugs. And this time last year, he was in jail after being convicted of false imprisonment and assault. It was a fall from grace for the 80s icon, whose career spans over three decades. Now he says he's found a new perspective on life and is definitely back on track. The album that I'm putting out first is kind of a collaboration of... Um, all the work that I've done with a guy called Kinky Rowland, who's like my main kind of, I guess the main producer I work with when I do dance music. Um, I've worked with him for 15 years and we've done a lot of stuff that's never been released. So we just sort of got together and thought, okay, well, this is great. Why didn't we put this out? You know, I mean, obviously I had other problems going on, so I wasn't really concentrating on my music. But um, now that I am, I'm kind of looking at a lot of the stuff that I kind of have lying around because, you know, I've, I've constantly kept writing. I never really stopped writing and recording, no matter what was going on in my personal life. So there's a lot of stuff that's sort of waiting to kind of be exposed, if you like. You know. The biggest thing for me was getting sober. That was the biggest change. I got sober on March 2nd, 2008. Um, I just had my two year anniversary. Um, that was the biggest shift for me in every way because, um, you know, nothing gets done when you're wasted. Um, for me, the last five years, there's been so much procrastination and, and so much, so many missed opportunities that I could kick myself. So, so my thing now is that, you know, I'm very conscious of what I'm doing. You know, um, I try to be on top of things. Um, I'm much more passionate about what I do, you know, and um, yeah, I don't like to waste time. Is there anything positive about prison? Well, you're, you know, you, you get a lot of time to think, you know, when you're in prison, you know, it's, um, it's an enforced kind of, you know, period of time. Um, and I made lots of friends, you know, I've got friends that are out now that I'm still friendly with and probably will always be friendly with, you know. I got so much support from people, I got thousands and thousands of letters from people I don't know. Mm -hmm. I always say thank God for strangers, you know, because people you know, there are, there are a lot of people that judge me, but there are a lot of people that don't. You know, there are a lot of people that kind of just have a lot of love for me and, you know, and I think that's so lucky. Amazing Grace is released on Monday with plans for an album later in the year. In the meantime, Boy George will be back on the road for a tour in April.